option, okay? Uh, if he's really strong, he can maybe still squeeze through this. But it gives me a lot of reaction time. If I'm going to uh, play this position to escape, I want to try to wedge my hand in this way and try to get on my side, getting kind of like a knee clamp. And then I start to arch my back, break the grip, and then I can actually go into an offensive movement. Um, we should tell me this. Like, <laughs> 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 All right. But the one I actually prefer is to like turn to the side and open. You can go ahead and put the choke on. Turn to my side and open the leg here. Right. It's definitely already open. Huh? It's already open. Yeah, it's it's very difficult for him to lock it in. Now if he's if he's staying in, like strong with it, I'll just kind of roll him. See, he's not really committed, so I'll just kind of stake him. Let's say he's kind of trying to drive through. I'll roll him, I'll lift him, and then you're kind of going to Mr. Unicorn Crank, or, ah, your turn. <laughs> now, what Scott should do to counter me, can you turn on your side and grab your leg? Counter. Is hit the old Ezekiel choke right here. I heard it. So, there's a lot of stuff that goes on from that position. I'd say telephone is probably the most common one you see, just because it's, it's, it's just easy. It's right here. Well, yeah. Out. The, the telephone, yeah, we, we kind of do that already, but it was that that wedge when you turn in. Oh, man, that would save my name. Oh, so much pain. <laughs> okay, let's try arm triangle defenses on three. One, two, three.